How's it going, YouTube? It's your boy, Tunerity here. Today, we're back with some more Dragon Ball Online. And, yeah, pretty much, I guess we're just gonna pick up where we left off on. Uh, so, I am looking for coffee beans. Eight coffee beans, to be exact. Uh, so, let's just uh, see what we got going on here. So, these guys are supposed to drop them, I believe. I don't know if it'll be like a guaranteed drop each time, or if I'm gonna have to kill a whole bunch of them. Alright, there's one coffee bean. Okay, so I guess it's probably a guaranteed drop each time. I don't know. Let's, uh... Whoa, what did I pull? Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're gonna go ahead and heal up here. Alright, nice. Let's go ahead and hit him with that, uh, what's this called again? Tunnel Slash. There we go. Okay, what is this? I, I don't, I have no need for a stick. I guess I'll pick up the mystery item. Okay, so, uh, and what's over here? I think I have another mission f for this place, but I'm not sure what exactly. Uh, new red knickers. What? Maybe it's in those. Okay. All right. Anyways, let me just uh, get into it. There's a lot of these transportation hippos. There's a whole lot of transportation hippos. Like, I'm confused. Like, how do they treat... Like, in the game world, they're called transportation hippos. So, like, do they just have a lot of... Because to me, I'd imagine... You treat them like a wagon. Like, you just transport stuff on them. So, like... Do they just have a whole bunch of wagons laying around, is what I'm wondering? Alright, let me see. Okay, so they do aggro. I was just making sure, because sometimes they won't. Uh, so, yeah. Noise. Alright, so I'm a little confused about that one. The red knickers. It says red underwear, red pants, army. Um, let's see, what does the quest text say? Maybe I can pick something out. Coffee house? Okay. So maybe it's that box over there. I'm not sure. Or maybe they'll just drop from random uh, enemies here. You can always figure out. Okay. Uh, God, I assume that's what I need right there. Okay. I'm just going to uh, try it. I'm going to go for it. So I'll have to be very careful about how I handle this. Because if I aggro too many of these, I'm done for See, like that one right there. I feel like trying to aggro him will aggro him too. So let's try it from this angle. Alright, closing some of the distance here. Okay, maybe... Okay. Now, I'll need to aggro him now because I cannot risk having him uh, jump me later whenever I get closer. Okay, now I'm going to eat real quick, though. Yikes. I hope... 
whatever I need is in that box. So there's multiple boxes. God, there's no way I'm going to be able to pull just one or the other. I'm going to have to do this separately. Try to do it separately, at, le at least. I don't like being in the middle of the camp here. Let me get closer. Okay. All right. This is giving me such bad anxiety right now. Item box. Let's check what's in the item box. Topaz, cool. Cool items all around. All right. Do these have the underwears? Yes. Awesome. So that's the first box. I need four more. There's a second box there. That one's going to be almost impossible. I guess I'll go for this one next. Alright, nice. Okay, so this is going to be challenging trying to pull this guy. So let's just kind of keep it Okay, there we go. That should be good. That should get her done. Wait, 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 wait. I didn't even see this guy. Oh my god, no. Please back off me, bro. Well, I need to kill this guy. Okay, so they're starting to respawn. The guys that I killed over here before, they're starting to respawn. Interesting. Oh, wow. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, that should free this spot up. Got two. Two down. How many more of those dogs do I gotta kill? Three more. Okay. And I need three more knickers, too. <gasps> Oh, nice. Now I need two more knickers. I'm just going to say underwear. Knickers is... I feel like that's treading a line. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, there's really only three boxes around here, isn't there? And this one is pretty much a death wish. I can go for it, though. I mean... I can try. Alright. Uh, dang, that is like three at once. I will literally have to take out three of them at once. And I will probably die trying it. Okay, so thankfully only I grabbed two of them. So I should be able to handle this on my own. Alright, cool, cool. Nice, nice. Alright, just got that last one there. Oh no, is this Buffalo Supply Unit? Okay. I was gonna say he better not come. No, 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 I'm gonna aggro him. I am so close to aggroing him from this range. It's crazy how close I am. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, no, no. No. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. Okay. Let me get this last box here. I think this is the last one. And then I've got one more of these guys to kill. i got to find one that doesn't have anybody with them. 
Okay. No way, all misses? Wow, interesting. Huh, compelling. Oh yeah, I don't know if I did I I don't know if I said this in the last video, but apparently to unlock Super Saiyan you you need to collect the Dragon Balls. I think I mentioned that in the last video, but I can't remember, so I figured I'd mention it here. But yeah, to get Super Saiyan you need to collect the Dragon Balls, which is something I definitely plan on doing. Uh, but again, like, uh, I have one, two, three, four, five. I did have, s did I have six? No, I think I had five. Because I know the dragon will automatically take them from you. Um, if you don't summon Shinron soon, but like. Okay, that's the guy I'm supposed to kill. I'm supposed to kill this guy. Running around all these other guys. Okay, let me follow his movement patterns and... Oh, oh, I don't know if I'll be able to do this. Oh. It's going to be a rough one. It's going to be rough if I try. Uh, frick it, frick it, bro, frick it. Sometimes I just like to go for stuff, so let's just go for it. Like, I am so going to die, but, uh... I'm stunned? Well, yeah, I'm not going to be able to do this if I'm going to get stunned. Holy crap. Oh, well, I did it anyway. Aggroing the whole camp, and there's no way I'm getting out of this alive. I don't have enough EP... Bruh. Did I make it out? Did I live? Did I actually live from that encounter? There's no way. I did. It says I'm not in combat anymore. That's why it's letting me fly. Wow. Awesome. We did it, guys. I took a risk and it paid off. Alright. Let's uh, turn in some of these quests then. Batra, how's it going, Batra? Uh, frog skin. There you go, sir. There's your frog skin, sir. Okay. Um. Going this way. Matthew. All right, so I guess that does it for this area then. Uh, so I guess I can move north from here then, I guess, right? This is, this is where my next quest saw. Any Dragon Balls? No Dragon Balls? No Dragon Balls. Alright, I have absolutely no recollection of any of my quests here. Let's see. Uh, robot Dashboard. Okay, so do I need to collect these? Okay, so... Maybe I gotta kill 12 of these? I don't know. But I know I can see here the des des deserter. Deserter. Oh, I forgot to buff. Okay. Okay, I I'm in the right spot. Alright, we got my buffs on and I'm ready to go. Got my buffs going, and I'm ready to go. Do the violent robots give me robot dashboards? Let's find out. Yes, they do. Nice. Okay, cool. Hmm. Uh, I'm 
gonna have to pass. I mean, I know those are a huge upgrade over what I have on currently, but like, they're just not the right gear for me. You know? Just not the right type. A lot of times, this game gives me gear that I don't even need. And I know that's MMOs in general, but like, I just wish I had better luck. 3 out of 12 gears. Alright, nice. So, uh, I don't know how many Star Wars fans I have that watches these videos. But, um... How are we feeling, Star Wars fans, about the current state of Star Wars? I know there's a lot of controversy. But, you know, we're pushing through it, you know? I enjoyed Kenobi. A lot of people didn't like Kenobi, but I did. I was thinking about making a uh, Star Wars channel or something like that. So, if that's something anybody would be interested in, let me know. I mean, it's hard enough trying to keep up with a, dra a Dragon Ball channel. You know, it's weird, too. I'm calling myself a Dragon Ball channel. I only upload Dragon Ball content, but I'll upload some other stuff, too, like uh, multiverses. Wait, what did I just aggro? Okay. Like that multiverses video I uploaded? I might do more multiverses videos. You know? Who knows? But, uh, yeah. I mean, it's fair to consider myself a Dragon Ball YouTuber at this point. And I don't really like calling myself a YouTuber because I feel like that puts pressure on me to actually be a YouTuber. But I'm not really a YouTuber. I just upload YouTube videos. If that makes sense. But, uh... Crap, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love this game. I've said that like every video, but I like I like its tone. I like the world. Really feels like Dragon Ball. See, Xenoverse 3 really definitely has to take an, a Dragon Ball online approach. Like, they have to make it an open world RPG. You know what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't have to be an MMO, but it has to at least be an uh, open RPG. Like, you know how MMO stands for Massive Multiplayer Online Role-Playing Game? Xenoverse 3 has to be a... Uh, open world RPG so you know it doesn't have to be online but it definitely needs to be uh... see it's giving me more spirit pants I don't need spirit pants I'll take them but I don't need them cuz like uh, Xenoverse 1 and 2 they're like arena fighters and they're cool and I think Xenoverse 3 can definitely be an arena fighter too but like every encounter could be like uh, how they did in Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Like pretty much the approach that they took to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot is the approach that they need to take to uh, Xenoverse 3, if that makes sense. Like the gameplay. Definitely needs to share some uh, gameplay philosophy between Kakarot and Xenoverse 3. I'm recording this at 10 in the morning, by the way, so if I seem tired or groggy, that's why. I try to upload one a, one video a week. I, I did. I was doing two a week, but that was starting to make me burn out a little bit on this game, if I'm being honest. Like, don't get me wrong. I like the game, but I think I like it at the rate I'm playing it now, which is like once a week for an hour, 30 minutes, hour and a half, something like that. So, just something to think about. What level is this guy? Level 39? Okay. Cool. I love this desert, by the way. Very, very cool atmosphere. Oh, snap! I didn't even realize this guy was here. Alright, nice. We just killed a dog. Okay. I got all of those. Now I need some more robots. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Here's the robot. I'm really not sure what I'm doing in this video, honestly. Like I said, this is my first time playing Dragon Ball Online. I'm like, I'm like, when I say I'm not sure what I'm doing, like, I don't know what I'm going to call this video, because all I'm doing is running around a desert killing robots. Maybe, maybe that should just be the title. 
Like, sometimes I debate with myself whether or not I should do some quests off camera, but then it wouldn't be the raw experience that I'm trying to capture, so. Oh, thanks for um, responding so positively to the videos, guys. Uh, I've had some people comment on these videos saying they appreciate how it feels like older YouTube and stuff like that. I just want to say thanks, you know. Uh, I definitely do, uh, go for that style, raw, uncut, unfiltered, just me sitting down and playing a game for fun. Uh, I try not to take it too serious because it's not something you should take serious. Like, there's some people who I see over-edit these uh, gameplay videos and they'll skip over certain stuff. And So for me, if you're like me and you want the more, you know, raw gameplay, just being real and having fun, you know, this is it. Oh, and um, if you want to see how raw and uncut these have always been, I, di I didn't finish it because, like, if you go back and watch some of my earlier videos, like Let's Play Dragon Ball Z Boost Fury, that is so bad because I didn't know really how to uh, do it, if that makes sense. Like, the audio is so unsynced from the video. It's just bad. But that was a philosophy I had even back then. So. Alright. I just need a... Uh, oh, snap. Oh, snap. Wait, what is... Uh, I guess we'll circle back around to that. But let's try this one. It says robot control device. I wonder if they're crushed... Because normally the quest tracker would show me where it is, but I'm not seeing it exactly right now. So is it pointing me in the right direction or wrong direction? Oh, maybe it's in here. Can you go in here? If you can, then I assume it's in here. Is there an entrance there? No. Oh, no. Okay, so... Um, did it just point me in the wrong direction? Oh, no. Maybe it's on one of these guys? What's it say? Uh, Andrew. Okay, I'm looking for an Andrew. Or maybe that's just the guy I turned it into. See, because I'm not sure. That's the trouble with this game. So much of it is not translated, you don't know where to go most of the time. Like, you really, you really got to figure it out for yourself. Which I guess is part of the fun. Part of the challenge. Alright. Uh, I I have I have uh, no idea what to do. We're just going to circle back to this one. Or maybe... No, that's just turning. Let me uh, check right here. I know I have quest for over here. So. Oh, there it is. Okay, now it's acting like... Okay. So I guess it just got off balance. I don't know. But now it's uh, telling me to go this way. So. Let's see. Is that it? Is that what I'm looking for? I think it is. Wish me luck, guys. This is gonna get, uh... This is getting risky. Alright. I hope this is what I came for. Oh, is it just checking for it and then it doesn't have it? Is that what's happening here? Okay. 
explosive robot device. Okay, so I think I understand what's happening. Maybe? Oh, a quest. A quest. Over here. Alright, cool. Bold management robot and tiger plunderer, tiger deserter. Okay. But first... Oh, wait. Now it's got an X on it. What? I am so confused right now. Okay. Let's try another one. I got it! I got it! Noise! Oh, frick. Deserter pig. I guess those are just turn ins over there. Alright, so what is this here? Um, I go up here. Tiger plunderers. That must be it. Okay. This must be the quest I just got. To kill these tiger dudes. Sir. Just don't. Oh no! These guys, I hate whenever they show up because they always jump you. Alright, nice! Is it raining outside? I think it is. You guys can't hear it, but it's raining outside. And every time it rains at my house, the power goes out. So, if this video cuts off early, that's because the power went out. And I'm just going to upload it like that. I can't be bothered to wait until the power comes back on hours later and finish recording. We'll just have to pick it up next time. Okay, so... I gotta kill 11 deserters and 8 plunderers. That's fair, you know? That makes sense. Oh, snap. Is there another guy over there? It looks like there's another guy over there. That's a first for me. Well, not a first for me. I've run into other people before, but like... Never this far out, I don't think. Huh, that's interesting. Look at him go. You think he's got Super Saiyan? Oh no, please. Please leave me alone. I'm just gonna run. Okay, cool. They didn't follow me far. Where's all the uh, tiger plunderers at? I'm seeing a lot of deserters, but... Not a lot of plunderers. I, I, and again, you see where it says this skill is still on cooldown? I know I've I've said this before, but I'm just a button mashing type. So, like... Like, uh... Like, I know how to play the game. I know that there's cooldowns and everything, but I'll still mash a button whenever I don't need to. That way, as soon as it is off cooldown, uh, it's being used. You know what I'm saying? So... I shouldn't. I didn't realize my EP was so low. Where's my EP pills? There we go. 
noise. So I'm assuming the plunderers are in a, a are in a different area than this area. I mean, that's what I would assume. Uh, we got any Marvel fans? I just watched Thor Love and Thunder, and uh, I didn't love it. Let me know what you guys thought of Thor Love and Thunder if you watched it. I know oh, there's a lot of... There's a lot of overlap between uh, fans of DC, Star Wars, Marvel, and Dragon Ball. Or maybe that's just because... I mean, I'm more of a DC fan than a Marvel fan. I mean, talking about DC comics. And I was like that ever since I was a kid, too. You know, I grew up on DC cartoons. Uh, so as far as the Marvel goes, the most I get out of Marvel are the movies. I don't really follow the comics or the shows. I mean, I'll follow the live action shows because that's easier to consume and they tie into the movies and stuff, but I don't really follow the Marvel comics or cartoons. So, but did you guys like that new Thor Love and Thunder? Uh, personally speaking, I didn't like it necessarily. Like if I had to give it a 1 through 10 score, I would give it a 6. Just wasn't that compelling to me. I wonder if this will... Dude, these dirty weasels are animated really good. Like, wow. Can we get a good look at those dirty weasels? Let me try to zoom out as much as I can. I want to... I want to try to get a good look at these dirty weasels. Where is it? Right there. Okay. Look at this guy. Amazing. Okay, so apparently there are uh, tiger plunderers because it's still showing it on the map to go here. But where? I'm literally not seeing any tiger plunderers. And I gotta kill eight of them? Hmm. Deserter, deserter, deserter. Maybe they're down here? No, because these are all robots. <sighs> See, that's the trouble with this game. I think it's bugged. I think there's probably more... There's probably tiger plunderers in another area. Because literally all I'm seeing is tiger deserters. I'll have to go look for myself. I guess I'll go do the management robot quest right now. I don't want to waste too much time. But yeah, man. Eight tiger plunderers. Huh. Alright, there's the bold management robot himself. A level 40 robot. Uh, let's just go for it. Now, uh, I'm probably going to die here. But I'm going to go down swinging. Paralyzed! No! Come on, bro! No, I don't want to target any other robots. I need to target this guy. It's all a numbers game, you see. No! You must die. No! 
All right, last shot, last shot. There we go, nice. See, I did that effortlessly. No sweat. Oh, a quest. <laughs> I need repairs. Hello, old man with the sword. What is this again? Uh, absorb energy from your surroundings. Cool. Alright, what have you got for me? Frieza? Wait. This quest literally mentioned Frieza. Where do I gotta go? Over here? Mm. Yeah. I have no idea why this quest mentioned Frieza, but I'm going for it. I am going for it. Uh, I probably should have healed up before I did this, actually. I don't know what I was thinking. I literally need repairs and everything, and I was just like, oh, you know what, I'm going for it. All right, nice, nice, nice. I am not getting away out of I am not getting out of this alive. I get that feeling that I'm not getting out of this alive. I can't even run. Come on. Did I get out of it alive? I think I did. I think I got out of it alive. Thankfully I got out of it alive. Alright. I, I have I have no idea why you invoked that Frieza name. Tambourine camp. Guess that's... I don't know where it is. Tiger plunders! There we go, finally! The, tr the map says they're over here, so these, are, these must be where the tiger plunderers are. There we go. Finally, we got somewhere. See, patience pays off. Now, uh, I do need to find some repair place because my gear is broken, dude. Look at that. You see that 20 out of 100? Jesus. In fact, I think I'm just going to go repair it right now. One sec. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. I know for you it's pretty instantaneous, but for me it took a little bit of time, but we are back. I have repaired all my gear, and I'm ready to go. So let's get these eight plunderers down. So as I was flying around back to this location, uh, I actually saw something interesting. So this X here is actually a little hub for more quests and stuff like that. So I have a pretty good idea. I have a pretty good idea of where to go for quests and everything like that. So... We're just going to keep going for it. Uh, I love this game. I love uh, all the effort I've been putting into it at least once a week. And, uh, yeah, I mean, sometimes... I mean, I'm don't, don't, I mean, I'm definitely open to the idea of being late. Like, just, like, not uploading a video one week. That's what I did with Dragon Discourse. Uh, my weekly Dragon Ball news series where I just talk about stuff that I found interesting or compelling in the world of Dragon Ball over a span of a week. Uh... I didn't really think interest anything happened last week, so I didn't really upload a video. And then I kind of combined last week's news into this previous week's news, so. I don't know. I might have a, inst I might have like a block where I can't really play Dragon Ball Online one week. And, uh, maybe that causes me to not want to upload a, a video, I don't know. Also, I record these on Saturdays and Sundays, but because my internet sucks so bad, they upload on Monday. Because what happens is, like, I'll, I'll leave it uploading overnight Saturday to publish it Sunday. I'll wake up Sunday morning, and um, it'll be like 50% uploaded, and I'm like, are you serious? But I want to do stuff throughout my day, and, like, my internet sucks so bad, I can't do anything else on my internet because of it being uploaded. So what I do is I uh, close the window. That way it doesn't cancel the upload. It just uh, pauses it because it thinks, uh, you know, pretty much the way I think it works is, I'll just go ahead and use this. 
the way I think it works is it thinks it's being uploaded and like you don't want it canceled. So when you open the uh, window again, it'll say your last upload was interrupted. Would you like to continue? And you can literally uh, upload the same file and continue where you left off on. So that's what I do and uh, normally uploads on a Monday. So I don't know, just interesting behind the scenes stuff that you guys might be uh, interested in, I guess. This is the last one. The last Tiger Plunderer, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the last Tiger Plunderer. Let's, uh... Let's fly. There we go. Alright, so... Going to Andrew here. Andrew's a big fan of the podcast. Oh, no. Did I really have a quest here that I could have got for more XP? Oh, my goodness. Mr. Hoon, what have you done? I'll go ahead and do this real quick while I'm here. Mr. Hoon's bag. I see, I see. Well, actually, hang on. I'll go ahead and turn those quests in. Because, I don't know, maybe they'll give me another quest that wants me to go where Mr. Hoon's bag is. So, let's just go for it. Okay, Shishi. I got the stuff. Andrew, my guy. Alright, new quest. Koi poised on black hole energy detector, McKinsey. Ah, oh, see? There you go. Mr. Hoon's bag is pretty close to where I got that next quest to go. So, awesome. Those weasels are probably my favorite looking enemy I've seen in this game so far. And I've, we've seen a lot of, we've seen a lot of enemies. All right, uh, let's just go for it. When I, I think, oh, well, I'll turn this in. Mackenzie, my man. <laughs> Runaway civil robot, what? Oh, <gasps> yo, okay, cool, awesome. So, uh... Oh, frick. So, that's interesting. There's Mr. Hoon's bag. I'll go ahead and nab that up while I'm here. So, let me turn this in. Didn't I have quests for runaway silver civil robots before? I'm pretty sure I did. I'm almost level 41, Jesus. I think this is it. There it is, yeah. I literally saw this guy. Okay, I remember seeing him. The name was familiar. I, pro I saw him in this video, too. Wait, I think I, think I took him down. Yeah, okay, I think I remember this now. Okay. Okay, interesting. Wow. Very interesting. So I literally already beat this guy, I'm pretty sure. So, I mean, that considered, that's probably why I was able to beat him this time as well. What the heck? There we go. <laughs> I was so confused for a second there. I was like, whoa, 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 what's going on? Okay. Mackenzie, I've done what you asked. I've done everything you've asked. Awesome. All right, let's turn um, Hoon's bag back into him. I wonder what quest I'm supposed to get to kill these guys, because, like, there they are. Just hanging out. F 
freaking monsters, man. Huh? There he is. He's just wandering around the desert here. Alright. Now what quest do you have? Maybe you have the quest to go to those guys. I don't know. No, still not. But this one's a Red Pants Army Assassin, so... Wait. Wait, what? I have a... New... Oh, I have three skill points. I completely missed this. Uh... Okay, increase the dodge rate. I'll need that. Okay, I'll need that. Okay, cool. Those are all passives, and definitely, I will definitely need some more passive upgrades. So, you know, passive skills are always handy. Okay, so I have no quest for these guys yet. I think it was like that in... Pretty sure I saw them, uh, where was it? Corn Forest. I saw them running around Corn Forest too, and I couldn't really do anything because I didn't have any quests for them. I saw, I, I had one or two encounters with them, you know, but, uh, nothing that serious, you know. Alright. Red Pants Assassin. There he is. Holy smokes, this dude is an assassin. Wait, he, he, no, he's not an assassin. He's more like a bruiser. Okay, I have an idea of what thumbnail I could use for him on the thumbnail. Like, which render. So, it won't be him exactly, but it'll be a monster in this game that I've already fought that looks similar to him. But I didn't use him on the thumbnail before, so I might just use this guy on the thumbnail. There we go. I killed the assassin. Some assassin he was. All right, now let's go. Let's go and uh, turn it in. Okay, Kuyu. Popo candy, nice. All right, so it looks like I am done with this little subsection. And uh, at least for now, let's go to uh, this place. Amethyst Park. I think I don't know. Boy, what a what a scene. Wow. Freaking beautiful, man. Yeah, it's more of a forested area. I'm sure I'll come back here for more stuff. I don't know. All right. Oh, this pig deserted the Red Ribbon Army. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hey, little guy. Get a good look at you there. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. I'm, I want to add him to the thumbnail. He's adorable. Nowadays, I'm just literally getting thumbnail shots in the video. Okay. Uh, he gave me more quests. <gasps> An area revealer. Oh my goodness. This is exactly what I was looking for. I love area revealers. They're so cool. All right, there's one. Hmm. Last one. I, I might not even have to kill him. Nice. 
Okay, what does the D stand for again? It's a dungeon, right? Like a cute little dungeon. But there we go. I opened up the uh, area a little bit. Alright. Oh my god, this guy abandoned too? What? I might just use this guy for the thumbnail. He looks... He looks cool. Okay. Understood. Okay. Uh... This seems to be the entrance leading to the ground after analysis an anal an analysis of various historical research this must be one of the last red ribbon army secret research institutes the leader is known as the legendary scientist dr jero in the laboratory there is a red pants army ambush there must be someone who can take care of this it means someone who has strength and is an excellent fighter please find a solution to stop this conspiracy of the red pants army in this lab Interesting. Wow. Okay, so that was the first quest uh, that wasn't translated in a while. This one wasn't translated. This one wasn't translated. This one was the last. This one was translated. Interesting. Okay. Cool. Wait. I completely missed this one. What? Realize I know you're very strong and brave. I need your help with the Red Pants Army, but be warned it's very dangerous. Those guys are super ignorant and cruel. If you can beat the a Tiger Advance Party on the North Road, I will be astonished. Okay, so lots of stuff to absorb there. Uh, where's the entrance to this dungeon thing? Uh... Well, here is this guy. Like, what did the dungeon... Like, what did the quest text say? I don't know. I'm not exactly sure. Oh, here it is. Okay, yeah, here it is. Looking for a robot. I accept Pela command. Must find the past. Peel off weapon. The remodeled peel-off machine. After constantly track that legend machine found in this underground lab, anyway, should get hands on that to see Pela. Okay, so lots of quests for this dungeon. Hey, this guy's adorable. Oh my god, this guy's so cute. What a design. How are you? So you are from West City? Ah, although you are dressed like that, right now I'm looking for clues about the robot abnormal events here. Uh, from the investigation results of the Westland, it can be speculated that the source of this anomaly is at this unknown basement. Although this is only a speculation. Ah, did you hear that noise from the basement? That The, the noise is 99.9% .9 the same as the robot corp production plant from Capsule Corp. It means that this basement may cause the anomalies in the manufacture of robots. They may be spread a virus. They may spread a virus. They may be spread a virus in the machine. Please help to prove my theory, but I can't fight... Oh, I hope you can go inside and collect some of the robot CPU and bring them to me. Yeah, I love this guy's design. Let me, uh, use him for the thumbnail. I'm literally, like, going in for every thumbnail. Alright, so I'm kind of at a crossroads here. I'm not sure if I should, uh... I think that's good right there, right? Okay, I'm not sure if I should pause the video and try to find people to help me do this or if I should just move on so I'll be right back okay looks like we've got everybody um so can I go in now I guess so all right let's do this uh, looks like we got everybody here. Um, Technician Jun. Here's an absolute prohibition of outsiders to enter. I wanted to say, but without a red pants army, these words become useless. This secret underground research laboratory devoted his life to the development of artificial human manufacturing technology. I was the respondent director for the institute, but they still the technology that I've developed. This guy must be hiding deep in this place where the desire to continue study. You seem to want to attack the institute. I will not stop you, but I don't want easily to lose my technology if you want to enter the institute. And I'm afraid I tell you about my manufactured terror into it, I don't think you'll win. Uh, blah, blah, blah. <coughs> okay. Time to join the land of the living. 
Holy crap. This is crazy. Is there any gear here for me? I can't tell. Okay. I had a... Well, it won't even let me open the wall map, but I had a quester, I'm pretty sure. Dude, he said we needed a full squad. Well, I guess we do. We're struggling a little bit. Holy crap. Did we even need a full squad? Anyways, yeah, so I guess I can just name the video U uh, UD2 or something like that. Whatever I called the first one. Okay. Look at all this gear. Like, at a certain point, there's just so much gear, I have no idea what I need. No. No. Okay. I guess I don't need any of that. Alright, let's try to keep up with everybody else here. Android 1900, huh? Oh, well, he's down. Ah, uh, no, I don't think so. No, okay. Any of this? No. See, like, uh, I don't know. Wait, what about those pants? No, okay. <gasps> Wait, I think I need that sword. Dude, I'm just going through just collecting stuff. I feel like I'm not contributing at all. Alright, dope, dope. Um... I wish there was some sort of add-on I could download where it just automatically collects what I need from these things, because I have no idea what I need. I think I need these. Hmm. Oh, remodeled peel-off machine, okay. so tall. Saucery left the party, what? Oh. I forgot I invited that guy uh, like a while ago. Yeah, I invited him a while ago. I guess he was too late to join. That's probably why it said he left the party. Because uh, he accepted the invite, but the party was full, I guess. is That's what that means. Uh, yes. Hmm. Alright, let me get this guy's quest here. Or this woman's quest. My apologies. I'm Caps Corpse and we're, uh, uh, we're just gonna go. We're just gonna go for it. I don't want these guys to uh, pull anything or do anything without... Uh... 
I'm trying to get a good look at her, that way I can add her to the thumbnail. Okay, that should be good enough. Okay. But what was she? I want to read that text. I guess you guys could read it. Or, uh... Yeah, I don't know. Oh, well. Oh, I see. We needed her to complete the mission. Same day, you have quite a remarkable strength. After the Shindong, you can go across the room to the culprit, but block the secret pass. You should be unlocked to defeat Shindong. Shindong is a very silly name. Shindong. Oh, wait. Android Doctor. Beat clone the Doctor Jiro. Wait! Did it not count? I don't know. Yeah. Literally, it all happened so fast. Are we done? Are we done? I'm so confused. Oh, this way. So, wait, we beat Dr. Jero. Did it count? I have no idea what just happened. Oh, we are done. I guess we beat Dr. Jero. I didn't even see him. I have no idea if we did everything. I think we're all done. Okay, so we're still trying to figure out if we can turn it in, but I'm going to go ahead and turn this in here. Uh, and uh, the place not the same is uh, blah, 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 blah. If your strength is enough, okay. So this guy is trying to decide if he wants to still do another one. Because I think I need to still turn in the uh, Dr. Jiro quest, so that's why we're trying to figure out if we can go again. If not, that's fine. Okay, so what we're going to do is, I guess we are going to run it again. So I'll, I'll keep this run in the video. We're just going to run it again on video. Uh, I think I might have missed a quest or something, so we're just going to go again. Uh, let's go ahead and wait for this guy. Hey, what's up? He likes to make an entrance. Okay. I guess this is everybody. Okay. Alright, here we go. Here's the turn in. No way. All that work was spent to develop the android's heart. Really, you eliminated android 19, blah, blah, blah. It's difficult to believe I spent decades of research, but I didn't think humans go that far ahead. If you really want to be the object of my study in the future? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, we got everything. All right, so I turned that one in. And uh, let's just go for it again.
Holy crap, holy smokes, this is where it all goes. To tell the truth, I could use some zinni too. I'm broke. Can't use none of this stuff. Hmm. Right then, yes, let's go. Okay, nice. Yeah, so I hope you guys are still watching if uh, if you are, because... Uh, yeah, I don't know, I just wanted to leave this second run in, too. There's no point in cutting it out. It's all part of the same gameplay session. Uh, I guess those are good, too. Yeah, I'm going to have a lot of fun comparing all this gear back and forth and seeing which one I need. I'll probably do that part off camera, that way it's not so annoying and it's boring and slow and stuff. Maybe I'll get a look at Dr. Jerome this time and I can have that picture for the thumbnail. Or maybe I'll even be able to turn in the Dr. Jerome quest. Wait. I need this. Okay. Well, there's the Android 1900. I can get a better look at him. He went down quick. I just realized this gear isn't like... Like everybody can pick up whatever. So maybe that other guy's picked up stuff that I could have needed too. I don't know. I don't know, man. We're just winging it out here. Holy crap. All this gear, dude. Okay, so that's the one that I tried to do, and it wouldn't count. So maybe this next time it'll count. Who knows? Oh, I'm stunned. Okay, I was like, why is it not letting me do anything? I'm stunned. A lot of gear being dropped and picked up. I wonder if I can change the settings to where that guy can't pick everything up. I mean, I wouldn't want to do it just to be a jerk, but, like, if he's picking up stuff that I need and he doesn't, then I need to figure out how to stop that. But I can't really see. Hmm. Okay. Uh, 
Dang. Okay. Yeah, look at all this gear. I have absolutely no idea what I need and what's necessary and all that crap, so... I want to have a fun time trying to figure everything out. Uh... Yeah, Dark Warrior got a little ahead of himself, I guess. Oh wait, this is a better shot of him that I could use for the thumbnail right here. Wow, okay. He's so big though, I don't I don't even know if I could. Dude, this is crazy. We're stunned again. I need that. Gotta have that. If I'm gonna loot one thing, it's gonna be that, I guess. Ooh, a 20 slot bag. Oh, here's the Dr. Jiro. Here he is. He's literally just Dr. Jiro, wow. Okay. Dope, thanks. Well, that was it. I have some gear that I've really got to go through and figure out what I need and what I don't and throw it away. And I'll uh, do that part off camera, I guess, because it's a lot of gear. I thought I picked up that last piece, but maybe I didn't because it showed somebody else got it too. I don't know. I'll go through that off camera, and then next time you guys watch, uh, I'll look slightly different probably, but... Yeah. Upgrades available. What? Anyways, thanks for watching. We are going to end the video here, so... I hope you enjoyed both runs. If you have something to say, comment down below. If you feel like it, subscribe. And of course, as always, guys, please uh, be good, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace off.